So uh, we haven't had a chance to talk to you since the San Francisco game, but I wanted to ask, uh, um, is with all the, the chip blocking assignments and everything you got in that game, is that is that a duty that's kind of fun in a way? Because sometimes the other guy doesn't necessarily know that it's coming or, or how do you uh, how do you approach that whole thing? Yeah, I think it's just a good opportunity to kind of help out our tackles against these uh, edge rushers that are very good at what they do too. They're paid to get to the quarterback. So um, any way I can help our tackles and, you know, it is it is kind of fun when you, you know, catch someone off guard. But at the same time, it's just the bigger purpose is just helping out our tackles and giving time for Aaron to uh, go through his reads and make a play. You can go ahead if you have another one, Mike. Okay. Are you, I mean, you had such a big year last year with the double digit touchdowns and everything. Are, are you concerned at all that, you know, your numbers aren't on that pace or, or is that just not something you worry about? No, we're the three and one. We're, we're good. We're sitting great. Um, just continue to progress as a team, continue to progress as an offense and that stuff will just come. How do you feel about the offense where it is right now after after four games? Do you feel good about it? Do you think there's still a ways to go? Like, what's your what's kind of your assessment? Um, I think just as a total, like as a group, we have like the best out there for us, like out ahead of us. And I think that we continue to climb every day, get better every day, trust each other every day. Um, we're just going to continue to get there. And I mean, we don't really have, um, you know, super stat goals or whatever we're just out there trying to be the best we can you know like I said every day and we're just going to continue to grow together and make this run what do you think of this uh Cincinnati defense these guys you know they're ranked in the top 10 yards and and points and stuff so far what what do you see from this defense when you've been studying them this week yeah they're big physical um you know they're football players and like I said before those guys are um, you know, paid to be great and they're a good football team, but so are we. So just excited to kind of get out there Sunday and have another good one. Is there anybody else in here, Katie? No, we're, we're pretty quiet today. If you've got any more, you can keep going, Mike. Otherwise we can wrap it up. Um, just for the heck of it. Did you, uh, did you reconnect with, uh, with George at all when you were out in San Francisco? Did you get a chance to talk to him? I know you guys are uh, pretty good friends. Yeah, I got to talk to him before and after the game a little bit. I haven't seen him, obviously, since uh, Tennessee, so it was nice to kind of, you know, feel one of uh, my good buddies in person and, you know, feel that energy and be around him, so it was good. I, you know, I, I know a lot of guys out there, um, obviously, from George, so it was good to see all those guys again. What do you think is what do you think is next for you guys as a tight end group? I know you're you know waiting to get Dom back. Obviously, Josiah's getting back into things. Um, you know, do you guys do you guys see more production coming down the road in the passing game for your group, or or what are your thoughts there? I think we just continue to grind as a group and get better at um, whatever the you know the offensive game plan is that week, and um, you know with this offense, we're important wherever we're at, whether it's pass run, um, pass protection, whatever it is. So again, not too worried about the production. I'm just more so worried about the win column.